Hey guys, I went to Trader Joe's today, so I've got a Trader Joe's haul going on and I'm gonna show you guys everything that I bought. That's Hubby and his cookie that he's eating from Trader Joe's. I didn't focus, focus me. Okay. There we go. There you go. Is it good? Mm -hmm. Okay. Anyway, we just finished doing some grocery shopping and I figured I would show you guys what the heck is in our pantry. So let's start, I guess, with some of the frozen stuff. Um, these are the Trader Joe's turkey burgers. Um, Hubby loves these things. They are definitely always a hit, right? Okay. Um, and then next we have these chili lime chicken burgers. These are actually my favorite. I like them better than the turkey burgers. Um, I think it's just the flavoring that they put on them. And it's just amazing when I read their ingredients. It's literally nothing but whole food. So, um, in here, it's just ground chicken, onions, bell peppers, garlic, cilantro, natural flavor, salt, lime juice, and red pepper flakes. Amazingness. And then in the turkey burgers, it's nothing but turkey, kosher salt, and rosemary extract. So usually when I'm shopping for different things, I'm looking for ingredients, the ingredients that they're putting in the food. And Trader Joe's, if it is a Trader Joe's brand, it is non-GMO. Um, and free of all other pesticides and all that good stuff. So that's why it's one of my favorite places to shop. <clears throat> we haven't tried these chicken enchiladas yet, but I picked them up today. I'm pretty sure they're tasty. Um, what's inside of these? Hold on. Where are the ingredients? All right, can't find the ingredients for that, so we're not gonna talk about it. Okay, next up are these um, chicken and cheese tamales. This is also a hit with Hubby, he loves these too. Nothing in here but um, whole food. And of course beef tamales as well. Just some things to eat during the week when we're hungry. <laughs> I have not tried these turkey corn dogs yet, but I hear that they're pretty tasty, so I picked them up. Um, I probably won't be eating many of them because I'm experimenting with um, being gluten free for a little bit just to see if that is kind of contributing to some ailment that I've been feeling lately. So I probably won't be eating many of these, but I may try a little bit. Um, but yeah, turkey corn dogs kind of takes me back to my kid days. I always buy these organic brown rice quinoa spaghetti noodles. They're amazing. They taste just like regular noodles, but once again, they are gluten free um, and just much healthier than all of the wheat and stuff that they put into the other noodles. So I bought two packs of those. This dish soap because cleanliness is next to godliness, right? Totally. So yep, yeah, we use this dish soap. Um, it doesn't foam up a lot, but gets the job done, so whatever. Um, I also like this Alfredo sauce by Trader Joe's. It's kind of thick, so I have to thin it out sometimes. It's kind of like clumpy, but it's still pretty tasty. And the ingredients in here are pretty good too. Nothing but whole food. Um, I always buy these brown eggs. They're just large brown eggs. And how much do these cost this big? 129. $129. What? Sometimes they're like 99 cents. And literally, additive and hormone free. If you have a Trader Joe's near you, I would definitely suggest picking up some eggs because they're pretty tasty. Um, this is my first time trying their rolled oats. They are gluten free, sodium free, high in fiber. So, I'm gonna be trying these out this month. We eat a lot of oatmeal and it's just been really hard for me to find oatmeal without a bunch of wheat and stuff in it. So, yeah. I'm gonna be trying those out. Also, their granola is pretty tasty. This is the toasted fruit and nut granola. It's also gluten-free. This is my first time trying the gluten-free kind, but I'm pretty sure it's, it doesn't have much of a difference. Um, Coconut flour, because I can't bake with regular flour, so we just picked up some organic coconut flour. Coconut flour is pretty amazing. Um, different things, you have to, you know, kind of change up your recipe just a little bit, but it still works out, and it's better than regular flour. And let's see what else we got here. Cocoa batons, just something um, sweet to eat when I want something sweet. Picked up some JoJo's for Bay. These are the cookies that he has been snacking on already, and we just <laughs> we just brought these back in the house. So he's been lying, eating. Guys. No, I'm telling the truth. You're lying. He's been eating all these up. I'm pretty sure a whole row of them are gone already. 
Um, we bought some of this 70% um, cacao dark chocolate. Um, Bay is like a Hershey's addict, so we are trying to get him onto more of a healthier tip. He actually likes dark chocolate, but it just takes him forever to eat it. If he were to eat a regular Hershey's bar, it would be devoured in what, maybe five seconds? Five seconds. Maybe five seconds. So we're gonna see how he likes these. We bought the mini ones just to see. Also picked up some ice cream sandwiches. Andrew, if you touch my ice cream sandwiches, I swear. Oh, those are yours? You thought they were yours? I thought they were for both of us. Fine, you can taste some, but I'm not playing with you, I'll baby. If you eat all these ice cream sandwiches. Can I get one now? They're so good. No, you can't have one now. Okay. They're so good, guys. Um, yeah, I picked up some chocolate lava cakes. I don't know how these taste, but we're gonna see. And I know it seems like I bought a bunch of junk, y'all, but I really didn't. I'm just showing you what I got. I also went shopping at Publix, too, so that's where I got most of my other stuff. Um, we always buy these Cheddar Joe's potato fries, fritatas. Also, these sweet potato fries are pretty good. I always buy these shredded hash browns for my breakfast casserole that I make during the week with a bunch of egg and stuff in it. We have not tried these sweet potato chips out yet, but I know that they're tasty because everything on Trader Joe's is tasty, right? I like these cinnamon apple snack sticks. Um, my god sister, when she was a baby, we would give her these all the time and she loves them. Her name is London, shout out to London. But yeah, these are pretty good. I bought a vegetable pepper medley to go with one of my um, dinners that I'm gonna be cooking. Of course, some of their chicken that is always additive and hormone free. Let me zoom in on that right there. Never fed animal byproducts, no added hormones. All vegetarian fed, so that's pretty good. Um, and of course, you guys, there's never gonna be like a perfect meat, a perfect whatever. Even if it is organic, it always contains something in it that you don't need, but hey, gotta do the best you can. And we got to try these in the store today. These are gluten-free um, rice cracker medley chip, and they were pretty tasty, right, babe? Yeah. So yeah, got to try those in the store today, and that is it for my Trader Joe's haul. Look at that mountain she of stuff. She bought me too, guys. Yes, I did buy you at the, the store, store, didn't I? And she wants to take me back if she can't return me. <laughs> You're unreturnable. <laughs> Completely unreturnable. Uh, the way I feel about that, I, I mean, it, it is what it is. I mean, it can't be perfect. Like she said, you always get a meat, you know, and it's not always perfect. And so you're that meat, huh? She wants to return me, but she can't. Yeah, I can't take you back to the store, unfortunately. And these are the cookies that he has been killing. <laughs> Let's talk about it, Andrew. Let's talk about it. Boo boo. Little light skinned fingers. You blend in with the cookie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, babe, they blend in with you for real. Aww, isn't that cute? <laughs> so, yeah, all the rest of this is my Publix shopping spree thingy. Shop all these Trader Joe's bags. I do like Publix. Publix is good for me. She didn't put Publix on the vlog. Because I like Trader Joe's and people need to know what to pick up at Trader Joe's. She didn't put Publix on the haul. You done? All right, guys, so thanks so much for watching, right, guys, and really we will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. This, this palette, and see how it turns out. So that is product number one, and now my fingers are all jacked up. Number two is they sent a nice little blender brush, nice little eyeshadow brush to go with this palette, I'm assuming. Um, it's really soft.